Welcome back to Pixel Piracy. So, in the last part, I decided to save scum. So, here we are, that's where we are. Well, to be fair, a bug killed my captain. So, let's, uh. Right, we're back here. We're back by the ship with the people that we would like to kill. Um, and still they will not man the cannons because they are technically still neutral until we decide to board their ship. Come on. Over here, everyone, at the same time. We must all be in the same place. And that is how it's gotta be. Oh, who is that stumbling at the back there? Now, let's see. Aha! My captain can actually step onto the ship this time. So, we're already doing better. There it is. Alright. Uh, <laughs> so many of them. Okay, and now everybody has knocked him halfway across the ship. But yeah, we got to take this really carefully. There's so many people on the ship. But if we can... Okay, who's that? That is Jeremy. Who died last time, in fact. Uh, at least last time he managed to die by actually dying, rather than... Whoa! Yeah, rather than just falling off the ship. But we shall tell everybody to attack this guy. He must be destroyed. Okay. Right, and hopefully... Maybe it's me pausing it and unpausing it that's making people drown. Oh, you've... Now you done it. You blew it. Right. Kill this person here. Uh, no. Don't run away. Get over here. Alright, so they are destroyed. Now, slice that person into bits. And Jeremy has fallen off the ship. It just, it seems to put them on a sort of random area, sort of, maybe some kind of area where you can place blocks, rather than one where there is a block. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what's going on there. Hopefully they get that fixed soon. I have, uh, the game has been updated since the last video, but they obviously haven't fixed that. Uh, but my ship has an HP bar now, which is nice. Okay, no, concentrate. You've nearly killed him. And that slice, there we go. Uh oh, who's, uh, what was that? I think that's a bomb? Uh oh. <laughs> right, who is slightly wounded there? It's the new gal. Have some bread. Stop for a sandwich in the middle of the fight. Right, uh, who are you attacking? This guy here. Okay. Actually, I don't know what that is. It looks like a bottle of something, maybe? Hmm. We shall find out in a minute after we have sliced all of these guys into little kibbles and bits. No, concentrate. I can just see them wandering off. Right, are you... No, you're back in the water again. Let's, uh... I mean, there's... I'm wasting these life boys, but then if they don't work, they don't work, so... <laughs> you know what I mean. What? What else is a pirate to do? Uh, let's try and get you again. Okay, are you stabbing him? Yes. Right, uh, I'm not sure which one of those there I'm aiming for, but whatever. I think at this point we're probably doing pretty well. Easy, keep attacking the same one. There we go. Stab, 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 stab. Right, how's everybody's health? It is looking good. And it seems like Jeremy is doomed to drown. I, I can't do anything about that. Apart from save scum again, but I'm not about to do that twice. Like, if the captain dies because of a bug, then so be it. But, I mean, if it's the crew, we will just have to put up with it. Alright, let's just uh, let him go crazy. Uh, let me turn my speakers down just a little bit. It's quite obnoxious when you get into a big fight and uh, little shing noises. Shing. Ooh, Viking blade? Okay, is Jeremy dead? 
Yep. Rib. Rib, Jeremy. Right. We got some butter. A Viking sword. Oh, a Chinese kaboom. These people are strange. They have Chinese explosives. And Viking blades. And Thor's undies. Hold on. Oh, shit. Don't fall off. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> I ordered him back over here while he was grappling. Is that a chest? I don't know. It is not. It looks like somebody's detached pantaloons. Did I just hear somebody's... Uh, tum tummy grumble? Nah. Thunder! Did we get... Yes, we got two cannons. That's what I was after. I mean, we've already got two, but now we have two more. Awesome. Okay, so now we have to lament the death of our crewmates, but... Yeah, let's have a find out. I don't know what that does, uh, but butter recovers five life. We can put that with the bread. Thor's undies. All right, we need to have a discussion about this. I don't know what that does. That is baffling. Um, I'm not going to put that on anyone, honestly. All right, so we're waiting for you to get five so you can learn that. Can anybody learn counter-attack? Uh, you could. So, you have that. There you go. Ugh, that was weird. And those popped up again. What else did I get? Did I get something else? Oh, I can see what that does now. Just like Kaboom, but it's weaker. Hmm, there's something vaguely racist about that. I don't know. Alright, grindstone M's. Can I use them on someone? Ah, oh, I should have taken Jeremy's stuff. Why do I always forget to do that? Uh, uh, nope, I can't use them on anything. So I guess we need to replace Jeremy right now. Uh, order Danger 4, more of them. Now, I don't know if they're all going to be hostile to me, but... Uh, we did pretty well, even without Jeremy on that last one. So I'm going to make my way to the town of Dime. Whoa, look how many towns there are up there. And they're not particularly surrounded by pirates either. Hmm. But yeah, I'm going to blow up another one of these ships and hopefully... Hopefully we do alright. They're drinking the rum! Is that, uh, is that a fix from the last version? I didn't notice it in the patch notes. Hmm. It may just be a coincidence. Oh my god. Oh, good gravy. That is a lot. A lot of people. Right, everybody. Form up. And yes, drink that rum before we go. Make sure your morale is as good as it can be. And yes, just chuck the bottle in the sea. Because that's not going to kill some helpless little fish. Alright, uh, I don't know who you attacked, so <laughs> go to space. Uh, what? <laughs> the OK is over there. No. Okay, pick on Blondie here. And stab. Yes, that's it. Right, you got to be extra specially concentratory here. Because that is an absolute shitload of people, and if you attack them all at once, you will die horrible, horrible deaths. I'm not giving you all my bread. Right, uh, is there a person to attack? I thought there was there. I think we just killed them though. Right, excellent, yes. Do that. If you knock them out of the pack, then we can just continue to pummel them. Oh, it's like bleeding as well. Which is awesome. Right, I think there's an enemy there. Uh, did... Where are the other people? I cannot see them. Um, yeah, it's a little bit difficult to see them, actually. Everybody is on 100%. Whoa! Okay, what was that? Oh, you know, I didn't check out that Viking blade, did I? Oh, well, I'll check it out in a minute. I'll we'll probably get some more here. If I can actually find the little things, my guys. There needs to be a better interface than this, there really does. 
Okay. Right, keep killing him, yes. These guys really don't pose much of a threat. Um, right, there is... Oh god, where is he? <laughs> Uh-oh. Yeah, don't go for a fly. Stay on the... Well, I was going to say ground, but it's not really the ground, is it? There we go. Okay, uh, this guy and his little Mario outfit. There we go. Stab, stab, stab. Okay, I think uh, I could probably... Where are you going, you idiot? Do not stand up there. Right, uh, uh-oh. Did somebody die? No. But you need to eat an entire block of butter. There you go. Nom nom nom. Okay, Viking Elixir recovers 10 life. Oh, I didn't notice that. But yeah, where are these Viking swords? 3 damage in 2.18 seconds compared to a rapier. Rapiers are better. Uh, Viking Blade, though, is better than the Viking Sword. 4 damage in 2.18 seconds. Uh, about the same knockback. 40% chance to extra knockback. Yeah, that's not too great, really. As far as perks go, right. Attack. Kill. Uh, this person. Right. Yeah, it gets kind of difficult to concentrate their fire when you can't find these little things. Right, somebody else is looking a little bit bruised there. They're probably fine, though, but you can have one of these Viking elixirs. And, uh, yeah, attack this person. There we go. Stab, stab, stab. Alright, so they've got it in hand now. You can mop the rest of them. Okay, what are you doing? Why do you keep going up there? Are you insane? You will die. Right. Okay, uh, everybody is looking a little bit bruised. But I think we're okay. Rawr. Is everybody okay? Yeah, nobody's bleeding. Good lord, look at all of this. Alright, we got some manga from that. Uh, get down here. Oh dear, uh, somebody is making hungry noises. Is there any food on this ship? Uh-oh. Uh, right. That's that's an issue. Right, we're going to put down the fruits because they are ready to eat. So we'll just throw them at the front of the ship. And we'll... Th well, you see, I want to... I want to replace these back walls, so... Yeah, I'm not going to put any meat in there just yet. Right, there's no chests or anything. But off we go, back to our ship. And... Alright, so order brick walls. I've got some extra masts and uh, I'm not going to be able to see the ship stuff. Right, so you're using the Brutalizer. Oh, we got a Viking Spear. 5 damage in 2.3 seconds. Uh, 2.63 seconds. Hmm. 10% chance to deal extra damage. Yeah, I mean, this Brutalizer is pretty good, actually, but if I upgraded this, I think it would be possibly better. I don't know. I don't think these weapons are particularly great, really, considering the lengths I had to go through to get them. But, let us see what the town of Dime has in store. Uh, hopefully a tavern, because I at least want to hire some more crew. And I also want to sell off some of the loot, uh, but yeah, what else did we get there? We got some other passive stuff. 5 TP on use. Really? Hmm. Awesome. Well, that can go to Captain Balthier, who already has 30 TP. That's kind of crazy. Well, now you have 35. And you have enough there to learn Fast Learner. You have to learn how to be faster at learning. It is true. It is the way of things. Uh, pearls. Yeah, I don't think I got anything especially cool. 
I don't know what Thor's undies do. I'm not entirely convinced they do anything. But yeah, we'll save some of this TP and see what kind of skills we can give people. Because uh, we may we may have to hire, uh, well, train another cook. But yes, there is a tavern here. Because yeah, I think that Jeremy was our cook. Unless I'm mistaken. Mm, no. No, I was not, not, not mistaken. I should just give it to my captain, really. Just give all of the skills to the captain. Ugh! Frame rates. Yeah, the frame rate's not fantastic here. I'm sure that's coming up on the video as well. It seems to be whenever I'm in a town with, you know, a tavern, because there's so many people here, and my computer is a piece of crap. So yeah, those um, faction bits are usually worth uh, a bit more than the bog standard ones, and they are indeed. The half wood blocks are worth 17 rather than 7. Or rather than 8 even. And they're worth 17. I'm not going to use them. We are not part of the order, and therefore we do not need those. I don't know, these uh, wooden walls might be quite nice though. Uh, right. Let's... can I click? Alright, so that's going to take up less space there, so... Right, that's got nothing, that's got room. I think there's already a wall behind that. Oh, buddy hell. Stay on the ship. Get in there. Uh, stay on the island, I mean. Go! Right. We want to remove that barrel. Yep, that's already got nothing. That's already got a wall behind it. So that one's the one with the room. Okay. Take them out and put the back wall back there. Yeah, see, it's just a slightly different looking wall. Uh, I like the way that the standard walls look. They look fine. Now, uh, do they sell by any chance those cannon windows here? <laughs> Because I've got deck windows at the bottom. They do not. Well, bugger. Because, yeah, I've got more cannons. I've got quite a few more cannons. I could put those, like, up top, I guess, and use the actual deck cannon windows. Uh, well, it's basic cannon. Uh, take those out. Use these, and we'll get some proper cannon windows for the ones at the bottom at some point. Uh, those are bombs. Let's get the cannons first. There we go. We'll put some more bombs up at the top. And i got to remember to tell them not to shoot those at some point. Uh, we got more mast. We didn't get a sail, though, unfortunately. But, yeah, we will put... There's a meat in this barrel here. And uh, put those barrels back. But we need to go get somebody the cooking skill, because right now we're just relying on fruits, which aren't going to last long. They're really not. In fact, I think they already ate all of the fruits that we put down. So we'll put those down. And throw some fish in there. Ready to be cooked. So yeah, that is an absolute priority, I think. And I, I don't think these shackles are functional either. I put them somewhere on the ship. I think that's them there, maybe? I don't know. But yeah, they did not... They did not capture anybody yet. So uh, I don't suppose any of you guys in here are former chefs? No? There is a developer. Alright, so let's drink some tea while I have a look through these. Hmm. A coal heaver. A duelist. I don't know, you have pretty good stat values. Your name is Kala Axelord, and I don't know what an ac Akata, I don't know what that is, but I will purchase you. And you are abstinent, so you are fired. Because, I mean, look at his wages. I have to pay that in order to improve his morale. Because uh, there's no other way, except for the beard that makes the morale go up when they attack. But, yeah, I'm just... Oh, it's actually Axelrod, not Axelord. <laughs> oh, you idiot. 